Hello everyone, my name is Regenza, and welcome to another rigging tutorial video. After going through the USRF list of equipment, I saw that one of them was a T-58 baseball grenade. Now, I'm going to try, and based off of what it read, I saw a picture and found something that looked relatively similar to its description, and I assume this is where they got the inspiration from. I'll go ahead and put up a picture right here. I'm going to be showing you guys how to make that. So, the first step we're going to do is we're going to go into Customize. We're going to click Advanced. Now we're going to have to go to the Avatar Shop and look up the Sphere. Now, I've never used the Sphere in any of my rigs. I don't believe, I don't believe I have at least. We're going to add this new accessory. And we're going to bring it over in front of us. Next, we're going to change its universal scale to be a little bit smaller. Some, and that looks about the size of a hand grenade. Next, we're going to duplicate this sphere, bring it up, and we're going to squash it down to where it looks something like that. And then we're going to bring it in and then down. We're going to bring it in where it now has this little cap on it. Now this will be pretty much the lid of the grenade. After that, we're going to duplicate it once more, bring this up, and then make it smaller than the one on top of it. And then bring it down. looks pretty good to me. Next what we need to do now is find the cube. We're going to paste the code of the cube in here. We're going to bring it over next to our grenade and we're going to scale it down to be very tiny. Once we've done that, we're going to translate it up towards our grenade. Once we've done that, go to its edit scale we're gonna make it real skinny, like that. Now, once we have this little tiny thing in place, we will soon be ready to attach it to this lid. Now that we have it set there, we're gonna go ahead and duplicate it and bring it over a bit more. Go ahead and stretch it to be a bit longer. Now once we have the pin created, we're now going to need to make the ring. To save ourselves some work, we're just going to look up a ring on the avatar shop. This gold septum ring piercing seems like it would do the trick. So we're going to add it as a new accessory. We're going to bring the ring over here, rotate it, and then proceed to scale it down to fit the size of a ring of a hand grenade. Rotate as needed and translate until the ring has been attached to and rotate it until the ring has been attached properly to the pin. Once your ring is put in place, we're going to change its object texture ID to zero. Afterwards, 